Clear sailing is coming for drivers in several parts of the region. More adaptive traffic signals will be installed soon in some high traffic areas. Here's John Shumway with a look new at 5. Using cameras and computers, adaptive traffic systems have become time savers, like on Route 22 in Murraysville. Well, it's reduced delays for people over 50% uh, in the morning and the afternoon rush. Uh, periods. Systems on the lower end of McKnight Road and Wexford Flats have also seen success as the computers see the traffic and make adjustments as needed. It's going to service the largest volume of traffic to help move the most people through the intersection at any given time. This year, the two systems on McKnight will be connected from Perrymont up to the flats. In Bridgeville, they'll be working to install the rest of the system and extending it and activating it on Route 50 as well as the lights around the I-79 interchange at Bridgeville. And further up I-79, PennDOT is going to be installing, well, let's say a small adaptive system. It will involve the traffic light at the Crafton interchange and the one down at the get-go. Those two traffic signals are very, very close, and uh, they really present a bottleneck on Route 60 for travelers. So we're hoping through the adaptive technology we can smooth out some of those, those bottleneck time periods and have a smoother flow for commuters on Route 60. This system is only one of three that are starting this year and will be in operation before the end of the year. We'll tell you where the other two are and look to the future as well coming up new at 6. In Robinson Township, John Shumway, KDKA TV News.